Amac on the mix. Ugh. Yo, what up, guys? Your girl Amac back with another quick tip. And today I want to show you how to change the tempo of all your audio inside of Pro Tools. And how we're going to accomplish that is by using a tool called Elastic Audio. Now, if you're familiar with Ableton, this is a lot like their warp tool in the fact that this is how we warp audio in Pro Tools. So first, let me show you that the song is a 140 BPM, um, and you can see the beat is lining up on the grid perfectly. Um, now, if I go up here and just try to change the tempo this way, let's say I'll go to 170, you can see that now the beat has fallen off the grid because the grid has been changed to 170, but our audio is still at 140. So let me undo that and show you how we can move the grid and the audio together to change the tempo. First thing you're gonna wanna do is grab all your tracks that have audio on them. And how I'm gonna do that is going here and choosing the beat. The two track is the first audio for me. And then I'm gonna scroll down and make sure that I grab all the audio. I'm going to shift and click. And now you can see all my tracks are selected that I want to be selected. And we're gonna go over here into the left-hand corner of your track menu and click this little clock thing. You're gonna see it's gonna come up and it says time based selector samples. We're going to option shift click and choose ticks. And now all of those tracks have been changed to ticks and we're gonna go right next to it and do the same thing. Option shift click. We're gonna scroll down to rhythmic and choose it. And now it's doing that to all of them. Now, I'm not gonna go over the difference between ticks and samples or the drop down menu for your elastic audio right there. In this video, it's just gonna be a little too much information. Just know that this is what you need to do to slow down or speed up the tempo. So now that that's all done, we get to change the tempo. So let's see how it sounds here at 140. Yeah, I'm winning, multi-million dollars on my watch. Okay, great. Now we're just gonna go back up here to the red diamond, click on it, it's gonna come up, and now let's change it to 170. Boom, and you can see that everything has gotten faster, but the beat is still on the grid. And now let's listen just to make sure. Yeah, I'm winning, multi-million dollars on my watch, I'm the realest, thinking you can mess with me, you wrong, who you kidding? I'm just kidding. But that's how you change the tempo using Elastic Audio and Pro Tools. And that's all I got for you guys today. Peace.